Hello folks, this is Ayat Kinacha from InspiredRise.com and today we have the Samsung Galaxy J7 Prime smartphone here with us for a detailed hands-on review of the same. So guys, let's begin. Samsung Galaxy J7 Prime comes with a 5.5 inch full HD display as can be seen over here the colors were sufficiently bright and the phone comes with the all metal unibody design and the fingerprint sensor on the home button itself. On the right hand side we have the power button and the speaker grill small enough which can be seen over here. It's very compact and can be muffled with the hand also. On the left hand side we have the volume rocker as well as the SIM tray slot and the micro SD card slot. On the bottom we have the 3.5 mm jack small hole for the microphone and the micro USB port. Under the hood, this smartphone comes with a 1.6 GHz octa-core processor, 3 GB of RAM, 16 GB of internal storage, micro SD expandable up to 256 GB. It comes with the accelerometer, fingerprint sensor and proximity sensor but sadly enough, on this smartphone also there is no gyroscope sensor. The phone is around 8 mm thick and weighs around 167 grams okay enough in the hand also and it scored around 46,554 on the Antutu benchmark which is a decent score above average score good enough and on the Geekbench 3 also it scored okay it was a decent score but not that great on the Nina Mark 2 benchmark we got around 57.8 frames per second which was a decent score in terms of software and everything else, it comes with Android 6.0.1 based operating system and on top of all of this is the TouchWiz UI which we have seen so many times on different Samsung phones, it's here also. It has a lot of good features like S Power Planning, S Bike Mode, Ultra Data Saving Mode, S Power Planning and a lot of other modes which allow for great battery life, reserve battery for calling, extend battery time. There are a lot of modes which focus just on the battery life of the smartphone and how to enhance it. In terms of camera performance, it comes with a 13 megapixel primary camera with the f1.9 aperture which is quite wide and it comes with autofocus and LED flash. The front camera is an 8 megapixel camera with the f1.9 aperture, wide selfie features, palm selfie, beauty face features. It also comes with a pro mode as well as advanced selfie taking features for enhanced beautification. Now let's just test the samples, you can see this image was taken from the front 8 megapixel camera. The details are quite good and there is quite less noise in this image. As can be seen the amount of detail in this picture was quite good. The f1.9 aperture does make sure that you capture a lot of field of view in this image. The primary camera also has a great field of view and the images taken from the primary camera were very sharp and there was quite a lot of detail in them. There was noise in some places, I would give you that, but still the camera was great and the quality was really nice. The f1.9 aperture does make sure that you get really good images and there was sufficient depth of field also in few of the close shots that I took. Let's just take one image for example. Uh, I took this image of a phone. You can see that the clarity is quite good and this image of uh, pineapple orange juice so that also came out quite good and has a good depth of field effect to it. You also get features like secure Wi-Fi on this phone and now let's just test the audio quality. The audio is okay at best with a lack of bass and is not that great. Customers of J5 and J7 Prime can get the Reliance Geo Preview offer and also the Vodafone offer wherein they can get 10 GB of data while paying only for 1 GB of data on recharge. The J7 Prime would retail for a price of 18,790 rupees and for this price I consider it to be quite overpriced smartphone though the build quality etc is good, camera is great but still pricing is a little bit high. So guys this was it for this video in case you liked this one don't forget to hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel this is Aitana Jha from inspiratorize.com signing off folks stay inspiratorize